looking straight ahead there, you, that's the path uh, that we just walked down from the gateway. And if I just pan around a little bit, we can see the river. So this is one of the most well-known spots on the marshes, um, where you can see those people standing in the distance. It's a very shallow bit. When the river's a little bit lower, uh, there'll be a beach extending uh, maybe a third of the way into the river. And it's a great place to come and paddle and just play in the water. Uh, you can swim, it's deeper further across. You can see somebody's put a rope swing in the tree as well. So this is a, a little bit of a gathering point in the in the summer when the weather's good. <clears throat> and uh, actually you might notice that this is a different time of day to the other videos. Uh, when I came down here yesterday, there were just too many people to film really. So um, I didn't want to, to film then. So I've come back hoping for it to be quieter, but there's still quite a few people around. Uh, if we just keep panning around, you see this this concrete structure. This is the outlet from a drain. Just a reminder that these are um, it's a, it's a floodplain. It does need to drain the water when the river floods. And if we just walk up to the gate, I'll do another video from the other side of the marsh later on. But here, this just gives you a little bit of a sense. This is a bit more open. Uh, the path here isn't surfaced, uh, but you can walk along the river up to the tree line in the distance uh, if you want to do that. So just complete the panorama round. Yeah, you can see there's a few people out. It's definitely a well-used spot uh, for local people, whether or not they're going in the water.